everyone knows Yoo Seung Ho because of his good looks and quality in acting. This South Korean actor really shows his expertise in acting, no wonder there are many films, Korean dramas, and music videos that he played in. He has been an actor for more than 20 years now, and his career shows no signs of slowing down. Here are 10 things you may not know about him. Early career. Yoo Seung Ho was born on August 17, 1993, in Incheon, South Korea. His journey in the world of glamour and entertainment began in 1999, when he was six years of age in a cell phone advertisement after his mother sent his snapshot to an advertising agency. He made his film debut with the low-budget family flick The Way Home. The film shows the way his character, a city-born seven-year-old boy gradually learns to appreciate rural life when he visits his 78-year-old mute but not deaf grandmother to spend the summer with her. The success of the film paved his way to stardom at such tender age and earned him the title Nation's Little Brother. He rejected offers for special admission into several universities. The actor gained attention back in 2011 for foregoing college to focus on his acting career. He had received offers for special admission into several universities, but he rejected them all. He candidly revealed, I didn't go to college because I didn't want to study. I said the same thing at an interview at the time, but the article excluded the part about me saying I didn't want to study and made my image better than I had intended to make it. In secondary school, I studied because my parents told me to, but I honestly didn't like studying. I still feel that way, so I have no thoughts of going to college. Maybe I'll go if I feel like studying someday. He has lost around 11 pounds while filming non-stop for The Emperor, owner of The Mask. Being the lead actor, he has barely been taking any rest days while filming for NBC's The Emperor, owner of The Mask. On June 10, 2017, Star News reported that the actor had not been taking any days off since the drama began airing. This was inevitable because as the lead actor, he is in almost every scene. As a result, he has lost around 5 kilograms, approximately 11 pounds. Following this announcement, the actor's fans have showed immense concern about his health. It was revealed that he was given a holiday on June 9 after a long time without one. A source from the production team stated, he needs to sleep more, but his filming schedule is so tight that he couldn't sleep enough and lost weight. He wants to break away from the image of looking young. Most Korean actors are famous for their faces that are much younger than their actual age. Some actors in their late 20s or early 30s still fit into a student role. Yu Ho revealed that he wants to break away from the image of looking young by avoiding roles involving school uniforms. He shared with El Korea, I've avoided roles involving school uniforms on purpose to break away from the image of looking young, but that didn't make me look more like an adult. As I naturally thought about how to go through that process, I became 29 years old. Now I think that time will come naturally one day. According to the actor, when he goes out to drink with his friends, they still ask him for his identification. He said that only his age increased, everything else is the same. Sometimes he feels like he's stuck in the past. He was able to put his child actor image behind him when he starred in Memorist. He is often picked as one of the best child actors who grew up to become great actors, but he revealed that it wasn't easy for him to go from a child actor to the actor he is now. In an interview with Star News, he said, I wouldn't recommend being a child actor. As a child actor, if you do well, it's hard to break that image, and if you don't do well, it's hard to continue on as an actor. When I started doing adult roles, I had a hard time and received a lot of criticism. Now that I've already gone through that, I feel more at ease and have a wider range of options to choose from. In early 2020, he starred in Memorist as a detective with the ability to scan people's memories who teamed up with an elite criminal profiler to track down a serial killer. On what Memorist means to him, he talked about finally being able to put his child actor image behind him. He said, since long ago, I heard so often that I have a child actor image and that I look young. Because of that, I didn't have much confidence in playing someone with a career. I thought that no matter what I did, I would look young and like I was playing dress up. But through Memorist, I was able to put a lot of those thoughts away and people around me gave me positive feedback, so it will be a lot of help in the future when I'm choosing my next characters. Memorist will remain a drama that I love very much and am very thankful for. He'd feel like a criminal if he became a real couple with Kim So Yoon. Ever since his debut in 2000 until now, he has not had a single dating rumor or controversy. In an interview when MBC's drama The Emperor Owner of the Mask came to an end, the topic of interest quickly became the kiss scene between him and Kim So Yoon. 
This was because many people were concerned if the kiss was real, especially because Kim So Yoon was still a minor. The actor explained, the director asked me to pull her in by the waist, so the scene looked really good. Many people asked me if it was a real kiss, but we really didn't kiss. Only our lips touched, but I think the situation in the scene could have made it look real. They were then asked if they would become a real couple due to their great chemistry, but he quickly explained, if we did I'd feel like a criminal. Military service. All able-bodied Korean men must serve two years of mandatory military duty between the years of 18 to 35, but most actors wait until they are older and have established a career. Yu Sung Ho enlisted before turning 20. He started his mandatory military service in March 2013 and was discharged on December 4, 2014. He did so well in basic training that he went on to serve as an assistant instructor. He wore his original army uniform in the last episode of I'm Not a Robot. He played the heart-stopping, perfect male lead who was allergic to humans in MBC's I'm Not a Robot. Despite it being his first romantic comedy role, he was able to pull of the sweet romance with his co-star. On the army discharge scene in the last episode, he shared, in the beginning, the director told me that the end of the drama had already been decided. I thought that as we filmed, the ending could be changed, but the drama really concluded with the discharge scene. There wasn't time to prepare anything, so I wore the army uniform and beret that I actually wore while I was in the army. I just changed the name tag and filmed. If I hadn't gone to the army, I think it would have been a bit embarrassing to film that scene. He finds it hard to make celebrity friends. The actor admitted that he doesn't really have many celebrity friends. He confessed, I do have a lot of opportunities to get to know them, but I'm too nervous to contact them. I want to open up to them, but the fact that they're celebrities sticks in my mind, so I feel too nervous to joke around with them, and I find it hard to be at ease around them. When it was pointed out that he too is a celebrity, just like the people who he was starstruck by, he just gave a self-deprecating smile in return. He thinks he can't date because no girls like him. Puberty is seriously no joke and can transform someone into a very attractive adult, and that seems to have been the case with this talented actor. He's grown to be incredibly handsome and total boyfriend material. During a 2019 interview, he revealed that he yearns to date and have a girlfriend. When he explained why he hasn't been dating, he thinks the reason is that no girls like him. He said, I really want to date, but there are no girls, so I can't date. I'm not lying, there are seriously no girls out there who like me. Seriously. Fans everywhere immediately came to his defense, saying that he has a bunch of female fans who love and adore him. When he was asked what he'd like to do with a potential girlfriend, he said that he hasn't really thought of activities he'd like to do. He just thought it would be nice to meet and just talk to each other, 